Yes, sir. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK, the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video, man. I figure I might as well. All the 2K news going around, I figure I might as well. I may as well weigh in on some of it, man. And I'm not even going to I'm not even gonna hold you up. I'm just going to get right into it, man. A lot of the stuff, if y'all seen the articles, y'all seen what everybody has to say, man. So I'm just going to tell you what I think about it. I'm going to begin at the beginning, man, at one of the things. It's just random. I just got a couple of notes here while I'm playing, and uh, that's just how it's going to be. The ranking system is the first thing I want to address or talk about, man. Now, they're talking about, uh, I'm, I'm just going to try to see if we can explain the ranking system a little bit. Okay, the ranking system hopefully will avoid things like that. You'll be playing, not only are you going to be playing with people more on your level, but um, hopefully what it is is that you will be playing with people. Go to the right. Go to the right. Okay, you're not going to be playing with people that are going to do stuff like that. Hopefully, I'm going to be playing with people that not only is it going to be that new players won't get, get won't get just completely slapped by uh, veteran players, but hopefully, it's going to be that wherever I go, I'm going to have trades up. Oh, my God, I missed it. I'm going to have competent players so that, uh, you know, if I'm a good player, I'm not going to get trapped in a game with people that don't know what they're doing. I don't even know what he was doing. He hit that! So, you know, I, I can't hit a wide open shot, but he hits a hook shot. Hey, you gotta love it. Will you please step in bounds? But anyway, uh, I mean, that'll be cool just because, like I said, pass the ball. Trey's up! Splash time! You can't leave me open for too long because that's the most frustrating thing about this game. When I have to play with people, I'm playing against a team of all elites or all, you know, whatever you want to call them. I'm playing against a team of all legends. And I got two brown shirts, and that's the only thing that I've got to play with. Like, I don't always play with my friends. I'm not always on with Brutus, Sam, and Nunu, right? So sometimes, you know, I just want to, give me that! The hell is wrong with you? I mean, I just want to play the game and have fun, but it's almost impossible to have fun. But pass the ball. Cash money. That's, that, that's not going in. Wow! So you miss open shots. But anyway, like I said, it's almost impossible to have fun when you don't have. I think um, I think this dude on my team is, is a computer. It's almost impossible to have fun when you don't have people that know what they're doing. When you don't have competent uh, help on the team. Do I got two computer players on my team or something? I think I got two computer players. Pull it. Cash. Pull up. Drink. So, you know, that's kind of rough. Um. I heard, I heard about the, uh, you know, the My Park After Dark thing. I think that's going to be kind of cool, man. I really don't know how it's going to work. Is that just what they're turning the park into? Or is that just, or, you know, or is it going to be like that all the time? I didn't see him say anything about park affiliations. And so when they talked about the new park badges, park specific badges, are they trying to say, get that out of here, dude? Are they saying that um, the badges are park specific? Like if you play for Rivet, you'll have, you can get certain badges. And if you play for uh, Sunset, you can get certain badges. Or are they saying like, like these are badges that you could only get at the park, if that makes sense. Like um, they're only for use in the park or you can only get by playing the park. And maybe you get them by using the uh, the three point contest or whatever. Come here, cat, oh my God, they're making me miss everything. Maybe you can only get them by playing uh, like the three point contest. Maybe you get an extra posterizer badge or something like that if you play uh, if you play the three point contest. Maybe you get a uh, park limitless range or something like that. If you play the uh, if you play the three point shootout, if you win the three point shootout a certain number of times or whatever, but uh, hey, either way, it's gonna be what the hell? I thought that was a damn computer, but the computer took a shot like that. That don't happen too much. Pass the ball. Oh my god, I think he actually quit. I think that is a computer. But anyway, like I said, pull up. Oh my god, get the shot. Pipe it up, I got them pipes on my turn. But anyway, I mean, either way, that'll be cool. Whether it's going to be park specific badges, like park, uh, badges that you can only use in the park, or part, uh, badges that um, only certain affiliations can get. You know, either way, that's going to be cool, man. I'll be cool with that. Um, hold on one second. Move, let everybody jump. Hit them with that. All right, kick it out. Pull up. Cat. Yo, I am missing everything out here. What the fuck, man? But anyway. Now, I ain't played this game in so long, though, dog. It is what it is. Get that out of here! And he hits that with me in his face. Uh, but, you know, it is what it is. Either way, that'll be cool. Uh, talking about the dribbling skills and how that's going to work, I feel like um, I feel like that's cool, man. And, they, and they're saying that they've blocked off certain moves by your... Um, here we go. Cash! Pipe it up. I got them pipes on reserve. They said they locked them off. 
uh, as I as I was hoping they would. Like if you, if you're a center, you can't just do Curry or uh, Curry hop step hesitation three and all that good stuff. So that's cool. Uh, they talked about they adding adding more defense where you can steal the ball with the right stick or or whatever. But you can always you can always don't hit that. Come on, game. Stop giving them that. You can always do that because that was one time when that's the only way that I played defense was was with the right stick or whatever. Man, you better get out here and play some defense on me, boy. What is wrong with you? So that's the only way, like uh, like right now what I'm doing now, hitting right and left, that's how, I, that's how I used to play defense at first. I didn't even use the left stick to play defense at all, but you know, it is what it is. But hey, uh, I guess we'll see how that works out. But, uh, and then like the layup timing and all that, like um, I feel like I've been doing that forever too. I feel like I've been holding the button for, uh, pass the ball. Oh my God. I feel like I've been holding the button until I feel, that should not go in. And it went in! I feel like I've been holding the button as far as, as long as, um, you know, until it's going to be a good release. So I, I, I feel like that's been in the game the whole time. Pull up, drink for three else. And it counts. I feel like I've been doing it the whole time, but it's all good. And then the dribble system, I'm glad that they got like a, uh, no, that's, damn, got dumped on. The dribble system, uh, you know, I feel like that's that's good because it's almost like, I don't know if y'all ever played League of Legends or whatever. Let me hit his ass with the reverse rack! Uh, if y'all ever played League of Legends or whatever, man, uh, when you do something, it, it's like it like it, it's like it costs mana. That's cool, too, because, uh, you know, you get tired of having to defend the, mo the same move 15 times. He's just going to spam Curry, Hop Step, and, uh, and Jamal Crawford, you know, 10, 15 times until until he uh, gets open or whatever, until you finally fall or whatever. You know, that's that's something that people don't want, that I didn't want to deal with. I'm like, after I, after I lock you up for two or three moves, man, you shouldn't be, uh, they're looking for a three pull up. There you go, D him up. Get the ball. There you go, computer. When you D somebody up, there we go. We'll take the goal 10 for game time. When you D somebody up, man, you know, three or four moves, you shouldn't have to, um, you shouldn't have to sit there and defend them more than that. When you play somebody in real basketball, after three, four moves, the dude is dead ass tired. If you go, if you don't believe it, go out there and do it yourself and see that you dead ass tired by the time you do that. Um, but like I said, man, it is what it is. I like that. It's like League of Legends. The more powerful the move, the more mana it's probably gonna cost or whatever, man. You know, that's cool. The catch and shoot badge is something that I'm excited about because as y'all might have seen a couple of times, when I caught the badge, when I caught, I'm hoping what the catch and shoot badge will do is like, when you catch the ball, you're gonna be ready to shoot. Sometimes on this game, when somebody passes you the ball, you gotta wait two or three seconds for, for um, yeah, I was playing by my damn self. I'm walking the fuck off the court. And then they left. Look, they gonna leave like I'm the damn problem. But see, like I said, stuff like that shouldn't happen anymore with an actual matchmaking system, so I hope that's what it is. But like I said, like, like with a catch and shoot bad, sometimes when they throw the ball to you right, um, you're not ready to shoot. Your uh, your your bar hasn't opened up where where it's a good shot yet, so you have to wait. So hopefully, um, you know, like and Diamond doesn't help that any, and and Dad, I damn sure don't help it any. So I don't know, you know, why people were saying that. But uh, when somebody passes you the ball, hopefully they what the catch and shoot badge is. You're already in position to shoot, and 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 to reflect that your bar beneath your feet is already ready too. And you don't have to wait three seconds or two seconds to enable, to enable it or, or in order to do it. So, you know, hopefully that's gonna be in the hot picks and stuff, man. I'm glad about that. What a lot of people don't understand is like, when something is overpowered, they used, we used to have to wait for a patch for it to get addressed or whatever. Now what's gonna happen is they're just gonna hot fix it right off the bat. So they can just tune some things without an actual official update. So somebody spamming Crawford, somebody spamming this, somebody spamming that. Like, like when they, when Crawford was broken and they could cross you up and break your ankles from half court, they will be able to address that immediately. And I don't know if it's gonna be like, like if there's an effectiveness number that's associated with each um, each move, but that would be cool if there's, a, if there's an effectiveness number associated with each move and they can actually just turn that down, turn down the effectiveness of that move or whatever, then, uh, you know, that'll be cool too. But like what I'm talking about with the shoot around, let's talk about this. Okay, so if I shoot the ball, when I'm talking, oh, damn, I play with no shot me. So it really doesn't matter to me. But sometimes, and I'm, I'm trying to show y'all what I'm talking about, man, what I'm hoping catch and shoot uh, will do while, we, while I'm talking about this stuff. But anyway, like I said, I play with no shot meter on. Uh, shot feedback, shot meter. I have mine on feedback on. Let me turn it on. All right, so when you pick up the ball, watch this. Okay, the ball is ready for me to shoot, right? Boom, I can do it. 
Watch when I pick it up now. You see how, oh hell, this is already ready. I'm trying to see how we can uh, simulate it or whatever, but I guess you really can't uh, in here. But what I'm, what I'm really saying is like, okay, if I'm moving around, or let's say if I do a move or something like that. Okay, well, you know how when you cover the meter, is closed. That's how I'm talking about. So when some, sometimes when somebody passes you the ball, that meter is closed, and you only got the little part of the middle. So hopefully catch and shoot will be, it'll open up. It'll be open. When you catch the ball, it's going to be open rather than, uh, you know, the whole thing. So instead of looking like essentially like that, it'll look like this as soon as I catch the ball because I have catch and shoot. So I don't have to wait a half a second. I can just let that bitch fly. You know, it is what it is, man. But like I said, man, all in all, uh, the hot fix thing is the main thing because that was that was the reason I didn't play this game until like half of the year because people were spamming Crawford and just dropping people from half court and the, the move was just too effective so maybe they can just turn the effectiveness number down or you know so, too many people using all this on quick I am a habitual abuser of that but you know too many people using that then you know hey maybe they'll uh you know maybe they'll tune that up or whatever. But you know it is what it is, man. Uh, I just had to get a video out to y'all because I haven't played 2K in forever and y'all hadn't seen me put a 2K video up in quite a while. So I'm just about to throw this up. Uh, you guys let me know what y'all want. If y'all want me to do like like a video, a short video for each thing, let me know because I can do that. But uh, like I said, man, a lot of the stuff that they're talking about, uh, I'm cool with. That was one thing that I, that I really wanted them to address. But like I said, I haven't heard them say anything about park affiliations. So I don't know if it's a thing in the past. Or, or what, or like I said, are those badges gonna be park specific as in rivet specific, or park, spe park, park specific as in you can only use them on the park. So, you know, I, I don't know about that. But uh, that, like I said, a lot of things that they haven't talked about, I have to think about those, and uh, because there were a few things that I wanted them to talk about, but nobody really had talked about them or whatever, so you know, it is what it is. But like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know, make sure you leave it a like, cause uh, you know, hey, it helps more people see the video. And uh, I just keep dropping news as it comes. I just didn't want, I mean, y'all seen enough news, so I just wanted to do a little bit of different take on it or whatever and kind of explain things the way that I wanted to explain it. But i tell you one thing, sinners not being able to do that, I'm not going to miss that one iota because it's ridiculous that sinners could do it. Uh, just just any any dribble move that they wanted to. It was stupid. But I'm out of here. Until next time, it's your boy Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. Hello. 60 out this month. Fuck. Yeah.